morning, Virginia lawmakers are tackling one of the nation's hottest topics, keeping your children safe in the classroom. The House Select Committee on School Safety will review school safety policies and recommend changes for next year. It was formed in the wake of the Florida shooting. House of Delegates Speaker Kirk Cox says it will focus on emergency preparedness, behavioral health resources, and prevention protocols, but not gun control. House Democrats say they are not happy about that. 13 News Now reporter Jacqueline Lee spoke with those at the center of this issue, students. And Jacqueline, they told you that they've gotten pretty scared since Parkland. Yeah, the high school students I spoke with said they're so anxious that they play out scenarios in their heads if someone were to come into school with a gun and start shooting. Students across the country are dealing with a new reality that comes with going to school in 2018. I constantly have to look at the door and think, oh, there's not a security officer there. There's no metal detector. 14 year old Reagan Young and her 17 year old sister Maggie May said the Parkland, Florida shooting transformed how they see school safety. My biggest fear is honestly seeing um, my friends get hurt or shot. And this fear has crept up in the state capitol. Addressing gun safety laws has been one of the touchiest issues in the General Assembly this session. It falls along party lines. Dozens of gun safety measures were killed this year, including background checks and a bump stock ban. Democrats have blamed Republicans. They're the types of common sense things that I think the general public is really in favor of, and we need to give a, a deeper, longer discussion on those things here in the General Assembly rather than just summarily killing them in a committee meeting. But Senate Majority Leader Tommy Norman said lawmakers ran up against deadlines and had the Parkland shooting happened at the beginning of session, things could have turned out differently. I think there is a lot of latitude in Virginia for us to improve gun safety. Where that compromise language is, I can't tell you right this instance. We've got some very firm Second Amendment advocates. But these girls say this goes beyond party politics. It comes to protecting kids. I'm done hearing this everywhere. I'm done seeing people go through this. It's really gotten really bad and it shouldn't happen anymore. Jacqueline Lee, 13 News Now.